Uh-huh. 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 Yeah. You know what it is, man. Jay the Hitman. Chrome recordings. What you drinking on, baby? Give me a Hennessy. Yep, Charlemagne the God, the Prime Minister, pissing people off, the ruler, rubbing you the wrong way, the architect of aggravation, and right now you're listening to The Last Call Podcast. Peace. Hitman. Yeah, what up? It's your boy Jay the Hitman. We back in the building. Last Call Podcast, the show. We here, it's your boy Jay the Hitman. I am your motherfucking host. I am live. Um, Today, it's Monday, October 12th, 2020, the day after the championship won by the LA motherfucking Lakers. Shout out to the Lakers, man. Taking that trophy home, man. Um, well deserved, man. Even though we was in a bubble, um, you know, pandemic, corona. Um, it still was entertaining, man. At first, I ain't gonna lie to you. I was not even into this whole bubble NBA shit. You know what I'm saying? I was not watching no goddamn NBA in the beginning. The shit was looking like a damn practice session, looking like less than college, looking like elementary school, no audience having virtual having ass NBA. You know what I mean? But I ain't gonna lie. As the shit went on and on, I kind of got into it. Um, it got interesting. Just because I wanted to watch some basketball, you know what I'm saying? Playing NBA 2K just wasn't doing it. Um, but anyway, shout out to the fam, man. Shout out to Archive Nation. Shout out to InYourFace.tv. Shout out to my whole crew, man. Hit squad. We in the goddamn building. Make sure y'all subscribe. Make sure y'all hit that like button. Make sure y'all comment. Hit that notification gang bell. Um, yeah, man, to get that content. Make sure you let me know what you're thinking so I can holler back. Um, it's going down. Excuse me. Um, LA Lakers have won the championship one more time, man, since 2010. And this is a special year, I must say myself, because, you know, the tragedy of, of, of Kobe Bryant, man, um, the Black Mamba, of course, Gigi and the other seven victims, um, it was a tragic start to the year, man. And um, and the year just went down from there, um, you know, considering. Um, so with the NBA, with the lockdown, as far as shutting down all sports and then coming back and giving us a way to watch the the, the games in the, in the in the bubble. Shout out to Disney, Orlando. Um, you know, that was interesting. So it got interesting. I wound up watching it. Um, now, truthfully, I'm not a Lakers fan fan. I'm from New York, from Brooklyn, you know what I mean? But we ain't gonna even talk about the goddamn Knicks. Um, Brooklyn, shout out to Brooklyn, Brooklyn Nets, you know what I'm saying? Kevin Durant will be back. Irvin, hopefully we got some shit popping, some shit bubbling up. Um, but yeah, man, um, but I've always been a fan of Kobe. I've always rocked with Kobe ever since he came out. I'm not even going to lie. Um, even when I was up top, man, Kobe just was insp- you know, inspirational. You know what I'm saying? Young man, um, you know, almost the same age here, a few years younger than me. Um, and, and I fucked with Kobe. I followed Kobe his whole career. So L.A. was like second home, you know what I'm saying? I mean, and due to that, you know, this was bittersweet, this whole win. Um, so, yeah, man, it, it was definitely special. I think L.A. needed it. Um, it was good for the, for the sport. Um, it was definitely well-deserved, man. Shout out to, to, um, to them, to A.D. Um, shout out to the whole L.A. squad. Shout out to Rondo. Shout out to everybody that played well, man. Them, them boys did their thing, man. Um, J.R. Smith, though, stop taking off your goddamn shirt, man. You ain't even played the game. Um, but yeah, it was it was definitely good. I can't say that I was mad at that at all. I was actually looking forward to the whole to the game, so it was it was dope. Um, but yeah, man, they won last night, man. Again, man, congratulations to the LA Lakers, man. And LeBron is just definitely um, he's different. I must say, I'm back with LeBron. Of course, like I said, I'm a Kobe fan, um, Jordan fan too, very much so. But Jordan, of course. Um, the older generation, and he's the GOAT. I'm not going to act like we don't know Jordan changed the face of the NBA. But um, Kobe was it for me. And then here comes LeBron. You know, LeBron coming straight from high school just like Kobe, it was interesting. You know what I'm saying? It was dope because coming up, he's today's Kobe. You know what I mean? Um, you know, what? LeBron's born in, what, 84? You know what I'm saying? Um, he went to St. Vincent St. Mary in Akron, Ohio. Um, straight from high school, straight to the NBA, straight to Cleveland. First round pick, you know what I mean? Um, the boy is fire, man. I must give him his kudos. I must say I watched a lot of his documentaries. I, like, I watched a lot of his um, a lot of his, his visuals, you know what I'm saying? And, and grown to realize the boy is better than 
people give him credit for. So that's why when he says give him his damn credit, or give him his damn respect, put some respect on his damn name, I'm not even mad at that because he deserved that shit, man. Um, what, he a 16-time All-Star, um, four-time Finals MVP, four-time NBA champion, um, six-time All-NBA, 2003-2004 Rookie of the Year, um, four-time MVP, th- three times, um, AS MVP, um, 2007-2008 scoring champion. Man, the boy is bad, man. We must give it up to the man. Um, and, you know, and the credit that we don't give him, he he, he makes sure he takes it. You know what I'm saying? He, he's a, besides his hairline, man, we ain't got much to say bad about the man. The man has definitely put the NBA on his back and various teams. You know, he got two championships with Miami. He got one for his home squad, Cleveland. Then he brought it back home for L.A. I mean, you can't have a better season or a better career than this young man is having. So I must say... Kudos to LeBron James, man. Um, and hopefully, you know, he got a lot more years left in him. Um, we got to give it up to him, man. Just wanted to come on here and shout out to LeBron James. Let him know. We here, man. Shout out to the LA Lakers, man, bringing it home. Maybe one day we're going to get it in New York. What? Hey, yo, man, it's your boy, Jada Hit, man. Hit that button, man. Subscribe to the channel. Fuck with your boy. More content. We in the goddamn building. Yeah.